Hi loves, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm going to be doing how I contour and highlight my face. Um, so yeah, let's just jump right into it. So I have my base on, which is my foundation. I went ahead and added some lashes and I did my brows, all of that off camera. So yeah, let's jump into it. Um, so right now, I'm gonna be going in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Cream Kit in Medium. Now, um, this is a high-end product, so if you don't have this, you can go in with any kind of um, contour color as far as um, to contour your, your cheeks and your face and all of that. You can also go in with the LA Girl Pro Concealer. This is the color, let me get it. Beautiful bronze. This is a beautiful color as well. So, yeah, it's like a dupe, you know, for the for this color right here. Um, it's this one's more warmer and this one's more to contour to actually chisel your face and to, you know, make your face look slimmer. So yeah, let's go ahead and go with this. Okay, so first, these do tend to get a little um dry. I mean, not like dry, dry, but um, it's kind of hard to mess with if you just dip in it with a brush. So I'm going to go in with my Rejuvenique uh, oil. Yeah, intensive oil. And I'm just going to add a drop in each one of those colors. So yeah, guys. Um, I went ahead and did that. So I'm going to grab my crown brush and I just use a brush like this. It's a little bit wider at the end. So yeah. Uh, okay, so first, so first you can either, it, it's totally your, it's your preference. You can contour first, which is to make your face look slimmer, or you can, you know, bronze your face first, which is what I will be doing today. So yeah, I just, it's all personal preference. I personally like to, um, bronze my face first and then I go back in and then I go back in and I go ahead and contour and I don't go crazy but yeah so I bronze first and then I'll contour next so yeah and I just I go crazy I go ham so yeah let's go so right here that is my natural contour but I'm gonna go slightly under under that uh, cheekbone. So, where's the cheekbone? I start right there. And I don't go all the way. Go ahead and add some more. So, yeah. Let's go up here. I contour my forehead as well because I have a big forehead. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just going to go up the edges. And then I'm also, actually I'm not going to bronze my chin. I will be contouring that. So yeah, that's a must. I'm just going to go in with a with my Real Techniques uh, um, sponge to be blending all of this out. And I like to go in with this side. I don't like to go in with this side of the sponge. This helps me keep it, it, it just bronzes around my cheek beautifully, so yeah. You see, it's perfect, so. Now I'm going to go in with the other side. Yeah, guys, um, I did, um, you know, amp up my backdrop. <laughs> um, my brother got this for me for Christmas. He also got me another one. And I love it. It's actually specifically what he bought it for. Of course, I could use it for anything, but I thought it was so cute. 
but he also got me those lips right there and I was like oh, so cute thanks bro love ya okay see how beautiful that looks and of course you can add as much as bronzer as you would like um but I also am going to go in with powder bronzer so yeah um don't forget you know if you don't want to go too crazy this is just like you're going to work type of deal which you know I don't want to make this specifically for you know anything just just to show you guys how I personally um contour and highlight my face so yeah Oh yeah, if you guys are wondering, my lashes are from uh, Lashy Box. Uh, it's a subscription that I get monthly, and it's $13.99, and I love it. I will actually be receiving one here pretty soon, so I will be um, doing a video on that as well. Fuck. Okay, so now... I'm going to contour my uh, cheekbones, make my face look a little bit slimmer. <laughs> you know, every girl wants that. So yeah, I'm gonna be going in with this shade and chocolate. And the other shade that I used was cinnamon. So yeah. And you guys, a little goes a long way. You don't want to go, you know, underneath your cheekbone. So yeah. Okay, so let's do my forehead. I want to be dragging that into my hairline. Of course, usually when my hair is done, I will not drag it to my hairline but okay so for my jaw um for my jaw I will be contouring my jawline as well you gotta make your face look even girl so you need to do that oh my god I almost dipped it in this I would have been so pissed Okay, I'm going to be going right along here. And then I'll just go on the other side. Under the chin. And drag that product out. Okay. So yeah, you can't really see it, but you just want to try because you want to blend your neck as well you know with that contour color you don't want to walk out in public and you see you know just a line under your chin that's going to look all kinds of crazy so yeah first I'm just going to work on blending that out really 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 good just wait you guys it's going to look Okay, so now I'm going to be highlighting my face. Um, whenever you're doing your contour uh, and your highlight using creams, you always want to go, you always want to use your creams first. So right now I'm going to go in with the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer in medium sand. Now I was very intimidated by this at first because it is very, very thick. But if you want that highlighted look, you know, that um, that photo perfect finish look, then this is this is for you. I'm going to blend that in to the bronzer just, just right over the top. to go around my lip okay. 
I like to highlight my chin and also my forehead. Um, mine is in the shade light to medium beige. This stuff is magic as well. It's really good. I always go back and forth. So I'm still going to blend it out. Alrighty, so now I'm going to set. If you can't pick up the Becca one, pick up the Airspun Loose Face Powder. I have mine in Translucent. They have like different kinds, you know. Okay, so I like for my sponge to be damp a little. You know, you don't want to go in with a dry uh, sponge or... I prefer sponge over a brush. I always used it. Um, I've always used my Real Techniques sponge to always set under my eyes uh, because I don't know. I just, well, I do know. I just, um, I follow, uh, oh my God, <laughs> I forgot his name, but he does Kim Kardashian's makeup and he always you he always said he always used a sponge that was damp so you know when I heard that I was like hmm you know it sounds a little crazy but it's like a filter on your face you know it's just like everything is blurred and you know I'm down for that girl totally down for that so yeah I'm just going to set you see I still have a little bit of shine going to um, go down now, go downwards, and I'm just going to set set my whole face. Don't worry. Make sure if you're going to use a sponge, any kind of sponge doesn't matter. Make sure it's damp. Okay, you don't want it to be like soaked and wet, but make sure it's damp. And um. Just, you know, pounce that in to your skin. And if I look a little dusty, don't worry. It's going to come together. I'm sure everybody knows how to contour and highlight. But I'm showing you guys my way. So yeah, I'm just going to dip that in there. So I'm set. Now I'm going to go in with my powders, which I already did setting, but as far as bronzing my face. So just going to go ham on the bronzer. I like a really bronze, glowy face. So I just go a little crazy. And I just blend both of those colors together. I go upwards. I'm gonna go in with two different bronzers today. So if that's too much for you, then that's fine. This one's more of a matte, so the other bronzer is a it's a baked bronzer, so it does have a little bit of shine because I like a little bit of shine in my face, so yeah. So yeah. I hope you guys had a great Christmas and a fun New Year's. I had so much fun. Spent it with my family at my mom's. And of course, your girl got drunk. Um, so yeah. So now I'm looking very bronze. Now I'm just going to go in with the forehead. Like I said, you guys, I put a lot because that's my personal preference and because I can. So yeah. So now I want to go in with the chin. You don't want to get forget the chin as well. Because you put cream down there, so 
You have to set it either with your powder or your loose powder, powder, compact powder, whatever, or your bronzer. It's still a powder, so. And I still drag it down. I'm gonna go in with the excess with what's left on my, I'm gonna go in with what's left on my brush and I'm just going to go on the sides of my nose, just kind of pinch it together. Just kind of make a, you know, go under, I'm gonna blend that underneath. And I'm not a pro at contouring my nose, I'm sorry. There's a billion videos on how to contour your nose if you want to contour your nose. Okay. So now I'm gonna go in with my Milani Baked Bronzer in Soleil. Now this, I don't put a lot, I just go in there and I just like to bring some shine, bring some life back into my face because my face right now is very matte. So, you see that? It just, you know, gives you some shine and a little bit of color, of course, because these big bronzers are really good for Milani and very affordable. So, see that? I'm going to do my forehead. See the shine it gives you? Beautiful. Okay. Great. So now I'm gonna go in. Okay, so now that's all done. The, the cream contour, the cream highlight, um, the bronzer. I don't use a uh, powder contour just because I feel like I don't like mine too intense, you know, personal preference. So yeah, I'm done with everything. So yeah, guys, that is how I um, highlight and contour my face. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more. So yeah, I'm just gonna finish up my face really quick. Just gonna add some lipstick. Going in, going to set my face as well. I'm going to be using my Tarte Ready Set Radiant Skin Mist. Just going to be shaking that up and just spray. And I'm going to be grabbing my spam. Okay, so yeah guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, like I said, comment, like, and subscribe. I hope you guys watch this till the end. Um, the giveaway is, uh, I have it right here, the Glam Glow Gentle Bubble Daily Conditioner and these little wipes to, you know, you can really use it to wipe your makeup off. Oh to uh, wipe your makeup off or, you know, to wipe this off and, you know, wash your face after. So yeah, let me know if you guys like that idea. Um, please comment, you guys, you know, give me some feedback, you know. Uh, let me know what other videos you'd like to see. I'm trying to get into the, the mood of vlogging as well. So yeah, guys, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye loves.